Hello everyone. Welcome to this channel. In the given question, A, B, C, D is a quadrilateral. Angle B is 90. Angle A is 90. Angle A, C, D is given as 90. Length of B, C is 20 units. And A, B length is 10 units. And we have to find the area of this shaded triangle. That is area of triangle A, C, D. It is an interesting ninth grade question and it is not very simple and not difficult. We can do this question in two ways. So we have two methods how to solve this problem. Because this is 90, this is 90. It means this AD is parallel to BC because some of the two co angles is coming 180. So these two will be parallel. So this is parallel to this. And if this is parallel, then alternate angles are equal. If this is theta, this will also be theta. So in triangle ACD and in triangle ACB, this angle is theta, this angle is theta. This is 90, this is 90. So we can say that triangle ACD is similar to triangle CBA by a test of similarity. A is theta, C is theta. A is corresponding to C. B is 90 and C is 90. So C corresponds to B angle. So by a test these two are similar and we can find AC by using Pythagoras theorem. So AC square is equal to BC square which is 20 square plus AB square which is 10 square which is 400 plus 100 500 and therefore we can say that AC is under root of 500 100 into 5 so 10 root 5 units. So this AC we found 10 root 5 we can say that for similar triangles corresponding sides are in same proportion so AC upon BC is equal to CD upon BA that is AC we found 10 root 5 over BC BC is 20 CD we don't know CD upon BA, BA is 10. So we can say that CD is equal to 10 into 10 root 5 divided by 20. That is equal to 5 root 5. So this CD we found 5 root 5. Now area of triangle ACD is equal to half into base into height corresponding height. So area triangle ACD is equal to half into CD is base and height is AC. That is half into CD we found 5 root 5 and AC is 10 root 5 to 5 times 10 so 5 into 5 into root 5 into root 5 so 25 into root 5 into root 5 is 5 and that is equal to 125 square units this is the answer and we can do by second method again using similarity if we draw perpendicular from this vertex C to AD. So we have drawn CP perpendicular to AD. These two triangles now we are going to prove similar. This is like this is the triangle. This is A, D, this is D, this is P, this is C, 90 and this is 90. This angle is x, let us suppose. If this is 90, this is x, so this will be 90 minus x. 
and this this whole angle is 90 this is 90 minus x so this will be x so x 90 x 90 so these two triangles are similar so triangle APC is similar to triangle A is x P is 90 C is x P is 90 C P D by A test of similarity corresponding sides are in same proportion so AP over CP is equal to PC over PD if we simplify it PC square is equal to AP into PD and PC we know uh, this is 90 this is 9 this is 90 90 this is a rectangle so this PC length is 10 only so we can say that this PC square is 10 square AP this AP is same as BC because this is rectangle opposite sides of rectangle AP is 20 10 square is equal to 20 into PD this is 20 because BC is 20 so this is 20 so 10 square is 20 into PD so PD is equal to 100 by 20 and that is equal to 5 so this PD we found 5 now this area area triangle ACD is equal to half into AD base into height CP half into what is AD AD is AP plus PD AP is 20 PD is 5 so 25 CP is 10 we can cancel this 25 into 5 is once again 125 square units so this is the required area so area triangle ACD is 125 square units that is the answer